Hey, what's going on guys? And welcome to Strive Plays. The fuck? This isn't Walking Dead. Oh wait, hang on, this is Life is Strange. Hey guys, what is going on? It's your guy Stry. And damn, I feel like I'm yelling at you guys. Sorry, my bad. Anyway guys, I'm playing Life is Strange. Um this is kinda like kinda like Walking Dead actually. It's supposed to be like episodic, like five episodes. This is the first episode. I don't know how many parts it's gonna be. I have no idea how long this is, but I heard this is like The Walking Dead. It's not by the same company though, not by Telltale Games. They did an epic job with Walking Dead though. Love the story, love the gameplay. Um, I haven't recorded any of that. That was all before I actually started getting into recording and editing and all that mess. Guys, I'm gonna play this. I heard this is a really good game and if I say something that's really weird, I'm sorry, it is really late right now. It's like 3 a.m. right now. And I have school tomorrow. I am so screwed. But anyway, guys, let's get into this. Okay, we're gonna turn that back, guys. Okay guys, so I'm a little bit sorry about scream When that uh, thunder hit, that scared the shit out of me. My headset was so loud, it blew in my head. It jump scared me. I just, it was not cool. But anyway guys, I gotta turn down and... Where the hell are we? What? Oh, is that a hurricane? We're dead. We are so dead. That's a hurricane. Get out there. Why are we walking slow? We need to get there. What's that over there? Whoa, holy shit! That was just beautiful. Oops, Gussie. Holy shit. Hey, that's what I said. So surreal. Famously called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. These I'm in class. Everything's cool. cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. And children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. So, she could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, 
I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, shit, man, it's too late for this. Okay, um, oh, shit, oops. Sorry, guys. I went through sound check and I didn't mute the whole thing. You guys are probably hearing it through my editing headset, not my good headset. But anyway, guys, alright, so. Uh, I don't know what to choose. Uh, I'm gonna go with X. You're asking me? L let me think. Um. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Brown knows her. Totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The daguerre oh, process you. brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely Photo popular. Photo so I already looked at everything. The first American daguerreotype. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Kitty glasses. If you guys have listened to me this far, the secret word is kitty glasses. But anyway, guys, we're going to continue with the story. Out all about him in your textbook or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. You don't see me. You never see me. So we're a senior, a high school senior, I guess. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. No shit. Hash marks. What's this? Class is turning in a photo, so. Huh. This might make a cool shot. I'll take it. And I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. I just really think everyday heroes. <laughs> we got blackmail. Macro eye. This? Of course. Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. I only want to share whatever gifts I have with the world. Bitch. <laughs> oh, it's a big old TV. Actually, that kind of looks like my TV, actually. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Let's go over here. Talk. Miss Jefferson, how you doing, buddy? This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Ah, uh, it's adorable. It's kind of creepy, but it's adorable. Excuse me. Uh, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Screw off, bitch. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I have to. I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you. Old dude. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Old dude, this dude looks like he's like, the oldest he could be is like 28. This dude looks so young. Of course, this chick is probably young. She's probably like, what, 18? Close to going to 17. Young, actually. But anyway, uh, I guess we're done here. Done here. Okay, let's go. Door. How cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying you always Welcome look to the real world. Just cute. Hot. <laughs> it's adorable. You think high school is a real world. You got a long way to go, kid. Trust me. 
What's the point? She plays it so shy. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant tongue. Don't not entertain it. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. I like the music in this actually, it's really chill, laid back. American I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. It looks like she's been American gone for months. Girls, like oh damn. Oh damn. Be part of the I never seen. Let's get a soda. They should just call it a sugar machine. Shit, yeah, buy a that Coke. Would be awesome. If you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. That's what's happening right now. Just buy a damn Coke. How much is it? 12 ways to stay healthy. What? That's wrong. <laughs> That's all wrong. Just buy a damn Coke. Who's this guy? I saw this guy. Hayden, Hayden. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro, but he's actually not an ass. What's this? What is this? Look at it. Look at it. What is it? <laughs> Damn it. Oh, what's she doing? <laughs> okay, right. I'm sorry, guys. It's late. I'm sorry. I like this music. It's really chill. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown except for me. We should check the stalls just in case. Don't be weird about it. Just check what. Rachel Amber. That is true. No, wait, isn't that the missing Jack? Write that crap. No, wait, hang on. Isn't she the one missing? Hello, is anyone here? This is the girl's bathroom. I'm a little embarrassed. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. I really like that photo. What? No, no! Damn it. I like that photo. When a door closes, Illuminati. the window opens. Triangle and I, Illuminati confirmed. Something like that. I don't really, but what if I was one of those guys? Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Yes, take a photo of it. Butterfly. Photo. Just get it the second. Oh. That was a beautiful butterfly. I like that butterfly. I want to get a photo. Hey, hey, what are you doing here? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell oh, me shit. what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. Wait, 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 wait. What what's happening? Fuck? How? How 
can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Yes, he likely was. These pieces of time can frame us in our I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color to Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, shit! Can you give me an example? Oh, uh, shit. I not believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, oh, you broke it. I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? What? Wait, what? Why Arvis? Because of her images. You're not. Faces. You feel like totally. Hold to. No way. What? I should rewind. Whoa! 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 Wait, what? What's happening? What's happening? I did it. What? I actually. What? Photographer who perfectly captured the human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't freak out. Not yet. Um. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep it together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes. Wowzer, my old broke when I took my selfie. Jefferson asked me a question. Oh, uh, shit. I forgot about that. If he does again, I'll know this is. Come on, really? Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not Oh, it's time to cheat. You all know the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a oh man, no you can't. You cannot mess with this stuff. This is the fabric of reality. You cannot mess with this stuff. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Oh wait, didn't we hear this one? Uh... Use the bathroom, I feel sick. Really? We're really using this stuff? It's like the oldest shit in the book. Uh, but, 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 I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody? <coughs> who knows Jefferson wants to keep me after class. Sorry, guys. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp, reflective style, like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. Oh, oh fuck you, you, bitch. Process. And give him the right you answer. Find detail in people's faces, making the second means you learned useful facts that may... Whoa. Okay, this is rad. Okay, keep going. Keep going. I think we could stop right about here. Heck, you going? Well, okay, uh, Max. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process. Invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work. Shit, yeah. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely. Suck a bitch. Mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. But you can learn yeah, more. People like you, Victoria. Screw off. Chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everything. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be in... Oh, man, we're going to go fuck with the fabric of reality. Why are we doing this? Wait, I want to mess the phone. I should have known.
She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Damn. That's a five hundred thousand. That's a five thousand dollar and three hundred dollar. Five thousand three hundred dollar. It's a camera, all right. It's a very expensive camera. He's turning in a photo. So. He's turning in a photo. So. Oh, this is rad. Take that. You still have to do your homework. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even Damn think it. about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Just give him the photo. Just give him the I damn photo. One of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm not avoiding. Not avoiding. Just... Fighting time, waiting for the elusive right moment. Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on. Now. Go back. Don't let me stop you. Go back. Whoa, 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 whoa. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Screw you. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Oh, John Lennon. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. I didn't like the look in his eye right there. That was kind of creepy. Victoria. You suck. <laughs> Open door. I hope I have Open a door. Open okay, the door. Bathroom. Please, please. Oh, no, 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 not that. Okay. Come on, baby. Hold it together. Sorry, I'm missing poster. We gotta go. Okay, Max, retrace every step. Uh, I walked the face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took yep. the photo. Sounds about right back down to the pencil drop. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do. I'm so upset. I need a hammer to break it open. To control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would Take ever it. even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Damn it! Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. In hella more trouble for this than drugs. Whoa. Nobody hey, we would have it, sweet. Break it! Woo! Made it. No way! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Oh shit. Oh, I thought he saw us. Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Whoa, whoa. Wait, can I kill myself? I'm getting dizzy. I can't rewind anymore. Oh, okay. So it's just a bad headache, I guess. I thought you could kill yourself by rewind rewinding. I was like, whoa! About to freak shit. Hey, do you hear that Maybe. That means you should I'm heading that way. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation yes. is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. That's right, asshole. Get away from me. Suck it! 
All right, let's go. We're we're home free. Thank you, Mr. Uh, what's your name? Mr. Well, wait, Mr. Damn it, Principal Willis. Principal Wells. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm. I'm we should probably tell just him. a little worried about my future. Are you sweating pinballs? Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. What is up with these guys just getting on serious and shit? Damn. Walking up on me. Uh, damn it, should I ride him out? She was a bitch, but he's an asshole. Yo, yeah, well, screw it. That asshole was asking for it, having the gun. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Good kids. Of course good kids can be, do bad things. Do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Hell no, that's his fault. I'm getting hit. I'm selling him out. What? No. He's he's gonna... Ah, oh, but what if he comes back and tries to kill me? What do you think, Max? What should we do? <laughs> she looks so scared. I don't know why. I'm mean, like, I know all the shit she's seen, but still, the look at her, man. She's just like, oh, slow down, Max. Slow down. Max, Max what are you doing? Stop! Alright, fine. 